Today I'm going to be reviewing this Koofandi men's knit button-down shirt that was recently sent to me by the Koofandi brand to create this video on. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to open this up, show you what the style and the material and that sort of thing is of the shirt, and then I'm going to try it on and see how well that it fits. So this is what it's going to look like after you get it out of the packaging. This is going to have like a polo um, collar, I guess, on it. I went up with the size 3XL. Um, is what they what they recommended based on my body size and that sort of thing. I'll show you how that fits here in a minute based on how tall I am, my weight, so you can decide if you should size up or not. One thing I did want to mention, there's not a top button on here. So this is going to come down a decent ways. But again, I'll show you that once I get it on here. One thing I did want to mention was the thickness of the material. So it feels like a traditional polo type material. So it's not incredibly thin or incredibly thick. So although this is long sleeves, it's not going to be the warmest to wear like at the coldest parts of the year, that sort of thing. Now, one other thing I did want to mention is on the sleeves, there's actually going to be a button for the very bottom, kind of like a dress shirt. Although otherwise it is a pretty much a polo. It does have that button there at the bottom. So just something you'll want to keep in mind with this being a button up, although it's that same polo like material. So I'm gonna go ahead and try this on and show you what it looks like. So this is what it's gonna look like when it's on. Obviously this comes down a really long ways, truthfully way, way deep. It has a way deeper cut on the collar than what I would expect in a shirt like this. Um, and there's no, like I said, there's no button here at the top, so you can't even like button it part way up or anything. It's just a really big gap there. I would kind of expect there to be a button like somewhere around there. So you could either leave it open all the way or button it part way up if you wanted to. The collar is not designed to lay flat necessarily. It's made of the same material as the shirt. So there's nothing necessarily stiff in that. Again, kind of like a polo would be. Now I'm a bigger guy. I'm six foot one, 250 pounds. And this is a 3XL. So it is gonna have a lot of stretch here in the middle. Lengthwise, I'm not a huge fan of it though. You can see how kind of short it is here on me i raise my arm you can easily see my undershirt on the sides and in the front so i do would prefer if this was going to be a longer one especially like because i got this oversized like a 2xl would probably still be plenty big here in the middle but typically a 2xl is going to even be a little bit shorter than that so just something that you want to keep in mind if you purchase this one the buttons on the arm i thought would be a little weird but actually it feels pretty pretty normal the length on the, the sleeves is also going to be pretty nice as well again i'm six foot one i do have pretty long arms so the arm length Length on that is pretty good. The only, my only qualm, I guess, about this would be this top thing here. I wish there was a way for it to button up, button up, and then also how short this is going down. But overall, definitely pretty comfortable in regards to wearing it here on on my skin or over my over a t-shirt, something like that. Does feel pretty nice.